So checking this out, I would say your internet activity over the last 10 years. You know, like, I'm not sure how much more you want to put in this. Like you're asking for final, but this is really, really rough still. This 10 years is being scrutinized. You know, like there are no blinks, there's nothing, there's no keep alive. There's one blink here. In minute, vivid detail. Um, you know, either you put nothing on it. I don't know. It just seems like you could do a little bit more. Just a bit, but let's pretend not. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is big. And for the other guy, uh, it feels like you want to do another pass on your on your mouth there. Your internet activity. Like this, you could go a bit further in your just one corner smile not that it's a smile but just the asymmetry of it push it your internet activity i can buy that your internet activity over the last 10 years is big. like that i don't know what i'm saying like it says years but then it goes in so either it's a weird shape in between or the years is really late but the way he says years over the last 10 years is big. see like years and it's you're going way too much into a you and I will really push the years that shape out. Last 10 years is being scrutinized. And then... 10 years is being scrutinized. This is very soft to be and the being. Like just... Like I know the actor doing it. Like he would have... He has a pretty open mouth a lot of times. Like he's really pushing his shapes. Scrutinized in camera. And again, the, the asymmetry is not quite there. And I'd be careful with eyebrows pointing here and then this guy pointing down where you want to keep this guy just a bit higher and you treat this as one shape. Like catalog, catalog. There's a bit more in the jaw and AO shapes, but you having... All I'm seeing is ow, ow versus catalog, catalog. There's a little bit more in the jaw. And that's very off here. Just again, asymmetry is missing. And then the this feels like an M almost. In my new. But it's in like it's too early. In my mute. And then my mute, mute, new. You would have a little bit of a jaw down. My mute. Whereas at that point, I think your jaw goes up. It's a bit weird. Vivid detail. Vivid, vivid. You want to make that v much stronger, and it's under the teeth. And this feels like it's a closed mouth. Vivid detail. <clears throat> vivid detail. Vivid detail. And the thing is, the difference between vivid and detail is not much except the jaw and maybe some corners up. But you want to be on your shape. Vivid. Vivid. You can almost have a, almost a frowny on vivid. But I will bring in the corners so that you have, there's a difference between vivid and detail e, you really want to go out especially since he's pronouncing it so clearly in detail. your internet activity over the last 10 years is being screwed. your hand here at this point very ik here of that wrist um, orientation is not changing there's nothing in the fingers either on like on a tightening like he's changing and leaning on this arms it will be a bit more of a change you got to pop that finger tip here. Ten years is being scrutinized. Ten years is being scrutinized and catalogued. This two here, once you go down, right there, feels IK, rotation not changing. It feels a bit broken. The elbow goes in, but the rotation of the hand is not changing. <coughs> in minute, vivid. Then you got this drop in the hand. With a lot of wiggle, but you can see this line here that's not moving at all. So it feels like a really broken hand <clears throat> with a lot of IK stuff there. And then it just locks and then nothing's moving. I just see a pop in the thumb. Something's going on there. Take the sound off other hand you know when you have stuff like this here there's a lot of movement on that hand but the fingers are not moving and it's weird to have also this finger kind of poke out so you can kind of readjust that pose to be a bit more comfortable and then i would take that middle finger out and bring that uh, index in a bit more and you know whenever you have movement like this you want to really track the fingers on that chair 
here your fingers, if I scrub, you can see it clearly, but you see out of fingers are really drifting. If you play this in real time, they're just kind of slowly drifting up. And then down is a bit weird. Here's a pop in your head. Track the nose, right? I'm looking at the nose. Boom! Suddenly here it accelerates. And then if you track the nose, it's here to here to here. And then, boom, it hits this wall. And it just kind of rotates back, but it doesn't finish that arc up. Kind of by that. Vivid detail. And I wish that his head would come... It, you know, it wouldn't do too much. Wiggle left and right. You have a lot of left and right here. And I would I would save it for vivid. Vivid detail. I would just tone it down a little bit. It's cool how you kind of like swing into it, but then the vivid. But then the vivid is so soft that I would make, I would delay each rotation by a frame. That doesn't make sense. Like right now you're, like you're back and forth. Let's pretend it's like this. And I would just instead of starting here, I would start one frame later, and then I would end one frame earlier. Hold a bit, you know. It's it's like you want it to be a bit faster and sharper. Vivid detail. Vivid detail. You hold and vivid detail. If I draw it out, it's vivid detail. Right now, yours is a bit even and slow, and you want to follow that sound of the actor and go vivid detail. You know, you you have your big swing at the beginning, but then your your left and right on vivid needs to be vivid detail, like fast and you can really follow the sounds of it. All right, that is that, and then this guy. What are you doing here, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? Hmm. What are you doing here, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? It feels a bit weird that he is so huge in frame, and ho hopefully you have some sounds for the knocks and everything, but. Like, to me, it feels like you would have him potentially here. Like, that's the size, right? So that when he comes in, his face is also this big. It's just this really weird small head. And that will give it more emphasis on the other guy. And if he comes in laughing, like, you could have the head looking over like he just finished a joke with someone else. And then turns around and as he sees him, gets into that serious face. What are you doing here, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? There's a lot of really cool, subtle stuff you could do with the face, but again, I would, the relationship, I would make it like this size. Maybe that's, that's the size comparison, you know, and then just frame it. So he's a bit more of the focal point. Like I'm waiting for a lot of stuff like here where I want to see this guy animated because he's so big. Um, but yeah, it's kind of first impression. Thanks. All right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.